Welcome to a brief overview of the atmosphere environmental gas cell for in situ electron microscopy. Atmosphere revolutionizes electron microscopy by providing nearly any electron microscope with the capabilities to perform environmental microscopy. Atmosphere converts your TEM from an atomic resolution vacuum only instrument into a powerful materials research and development laboratory. Now conduct experiments under realistic reaction conditions at temperatures up to 1000 degrees Celsius and pressures up to one atmosphere with a variety of different gases. Atmosphere takes full advantage of the resolving power of modern TEMs. High resolution combined with real world reaction conditions provides entirely new methods for studying materials that yield more meaningful results. Atmosphere makes in situ environmental experiments easy with the fully automated custom software control and workflow. Atmosphere is well suited for studying the reduction and oxidation behavior of heterogeneous catalysts, the process of corrosion and understanding fundamental material properties under well-controlled environments. Atmosphere reproduces these environments in the TEM, so the specific chemical reactions can be observed and new methods developed. Thermal experiments including sintering, sublimation, and phase changes often yield spurious results when done in high vacuum, as materials can act differently when compared to atmospheric pressure conditions. Atmosphere maintains instrument resolution under high pressure and temperature, enabling atom-by-atom -atom analysis. The left figure is a bright field TEM image of titanium dioxide taken at one atmosphere of hydrogen and 600 degrees Celsius. An FFT of the image, shown in the inset, indicates a lattice resolution of 0.8 angstroms, demonstrating the ultra-high stability of atmosphere. Similarly, atomic resolution stem images are routine, as shown in the right image, where a cerium dioxide nanoparticle is displayed with a resolution of 1.3 angstroms. This was taken at one atmosphere of 95 5% nitrogen hydrogen at 500 degrees Celsius. The power of in situ microscopy is best demonstrated when dynamic behavior such as material-material interactions and gas-solid reactions is observed moment by moment at the atomic scale. This ability imparts the scientists with a profound advantage when studying material properties. If a sample is exposed to just the right conditions, important dynamic reactions occur, such as in the video shown here, where few layer graphene is etched using iron nanoparticles. When heated to 900 degrees Celsius under 600 torr of hydrogen, iron reacts with and etches the graphene lattice, creating trenches along specific orientations of the graphene crystal lattice. The video shows the dynamics of this reaction, including which facets of the iron nanoparticle etch the graphene and the direction of etching. Processes can also be followed step by step so important changes in behaviors are not missed. In this example, iron oxide is reduced to FeO, and finally to metallic iron at high temperatures and at 150 torr of hydrogen. The changes in the crystal lattice can be tracked step by step and are apparent in the series of high-resolution bright field TEM images. Selected area diffraction and FFTs can be used to confirm the phase changes. In heterogeneous catalysis, viewing changes moment by moment under controlled conditions such as reduction and oxidation at high temperature enables scientists to more accurately understand and create more effective materials. In this example, rhodium-doped calcium titanate is exposed to reduction conditions, 95 5% nitrogen hydrogen at 550 degrees Celsius. Under these conditions, the rhodium becomes mobile and agglomerates into large nanoparticles and nanoclusters. How large these particles and clusters become, how they interact with calcium titanate substrate, and where they form 
are all important factors which are visualized and tracked in real time. Most TEMs today have analysis tools such as Energy Dispersive X-ray Spectroscopy, or EDS, and Electron Energy Loss Spectroscopy, or EELS. Often, in-situ systems are incompatible with analysis tools. Atmosphere was specifically designed to take advantage of EDS and EELS to enable high-quality and versatile material analysis before, during, and after the experiment. In this example, a platinum cobalt catalyst decorated with gold nanoparticles was mapped using EDS, and the spectrum images of gold and platinum are shown at the top, indicating the locations of each element. A core loss yield spectrum of iron oxide displayed in the bottom figure clearly shows both the oxygen and iron ionization edges. Atmosphere creates a new class of in-situ TEM products between holder-only closed-cell designs and dedicated instruments such as the ETEM. Simple holder-based designs, while cheap, are limited in their use, do not incorporate sufficient safety features, and could potentially void the microscope's warranty. In contrast, the dedicated environmental TEM is expensive, has a limited pressure range, and is complicated to use. Atmosphere is a new category with moderate cost, real-world pressures, and temperatures, and is TEM vendor-approved. Atmosphere is a holder-based design and fits nearly all JEOL, FEI, and Hitachi TEMs on the market. It converts your TEM into a fully functional environmental TEM without making any modifications to the microscope. It significantly broadens the capability of the laboratory, enabling new research focus areas in catalysis, energy materials, fundamental analysis, and corrosion. The Atmosphere workflow-based software provides fully automated gas handling, pressure and temperature logging, closed-loop temperature control, and complete system monitoring. This video details part of the automated pump and purge process used to quickly remove residual gases from the system to ensure the manifold is clean and experiment gases remain ultra pure. The fully automated software-based approach makes atmosphere safe and easy to use for highly reproducible experiments on your TEM. The patented atmosphere ECHIP devices are a core component of the atmosphere system. An ECHIP pair creates the environmental cell inside the holder tip. One ECHIP features an amorphous silicon nitride window, and the second features a proprietary ceramic membrane, which is a sample support and heat source. The silicon nitride window is electron transparent and provides a strong barrier to reliably contain gases up to one atmosphere for extended periods. The atmosphere software controls the thermal ECHIP device and uses protochip smart temp closed loop control to automatically compensate for gas type or pressure. Atmosphere is a complete solution for environmental TEM experiments. Each component, including the gas handling and delivery system, the software controller, holder, and ECHIPs all work seamlessly together for a full-featured solution. It's easy to use for the novice to expert microscopist alike. It's safe and provides high performance resolution at temperature and pressure. Atmosphere is designed to enable systematic, reproducible results to help you discover new material properties and behavior. We hope that this overview has been helpful. If your research needs and objectives align with the capabilities of the Atmosphere system, please contact us at contact at protochips.com or visit our website, protochips.com, for more detailed information, application notes, and white papers.